This is the TI-36X Pro. What I want to do is I want to put the standard deviation. Well, I want the standard deviation from this table. All right, let's try that again. This is the TI-36X Pro, and I want to find the standard deviation of this table. So to do that, we got to put these numbers in a list in the, in the calculator. So we press data. And I'm going to press data again to clear all the uh, list, the columns, the list. It's a, it's a list. And we have three lists. So I'm going to put the data. One, enter, two, enter, three, enter, four, enter, five, enter. And then we're going to go on the other side. Ten, enter, fifteen, enter, twenty, enter, fifteen, enter, and ten, enter. Always good to check to see if you enter the values right. So 1, 10, 2, 15, 20, 15, 4, 15, 5, 10. Okay, that looks correct. <clears throat> okay, now we're going to go over here. It's a stat distribution in light blue. So light blue button first and then data. And this still is a one variable data set. How come? Well, I have 10 ones. So I'll one, two, three, four, five, six until 10. And then 15 twos. One, two, three, up to 15 of them, and so on. Okay? So this is still one variable. This is not like one of those tables. This is a frequency is a frequency distribution table. This is not one of those tables that are X, Y, okay? Um, which, you know, you can plot points. That's for a different subject. So one variable. So I go to one variable stats and then press two or move down to two. This is important. L1, this is L1, the column L1 on my calculator. You gotta tell the calculator you have an L2, which is your frequency. So you go down, go across, you have to enter. So now L1 and L2 are locked, then press enter or calculate. And the standard deviation is S, in this case it will be SX. So we go here, and that's 1.2626. That's perfect, great. 